welcome back to an Atlas video. Um, so we're going to be doing a many part series on mod boats, um, starting with the Tramp Freighter. Um, so the Tramp Freighter is a basic boat that you can build in a basic common shipyard. Um, so when you build this, um, it'll, it's very, very cheap. Um, I'm going to throw it up on the screen. Um, that's what it takes to, you know, build the Tramp Freighter in the shipyard. Um, and when you build it, it pops up looking like this. Um, it has railings on it with four cargo racks. So it comes with four cargo racks. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to test the speeds of how it comes with the four cargo racks and two, I believe it's two um, large weight sails. Um, and we're gonna test the speed on with the four. Um, so, um, so let me go grab some NPCs real quick, and I'll be right back. All right, so I'm back. Um, so recap again. It's got two. It's got four cargo racks, and it's actually. I'm sorry. It's it comes with a large weight sail and a medium weight sail. So we're going to test it out how it comes with the four racks, the speed. So here we go. All right, we're going to go full wind with the four racks. And let's see how fast this goes. So we got kind of yucky win, but so we've got it. It's a going about, let's say 12.5 knots consistent. That's with the four cargo containers. So what we're going to end up doing is we're going to empty one of these cargo containers and we're going to see if that changes anything on this tram freighter. You kind of can notice that you've, we've already, you can tell the pickup speed is a lot faster with one rack dropped. So we're going about 15, oh, look at us go. So 17.5 with one cargo rack dropped. Okay. Um, so we're going to go and we're going to actually drop another cargo rack. And we're going to see if that makes any difference. So we had 12.5 with all racks. Then we had, I think I, I said it was. Seventeen point five with one and we're about seventeen point seven. So it didn't really change that too, too much. So we're going to drop one more rack. And let's see if we go any faster than 17.5. So we're at like 17.7. So it didn't change too much. So all in all, I would say when you build your tram freighter, you would want to at least drop one rack to get the max speed on your tram freighter. Um, so now what we're going to do is we're going to end up, let's demo these. We're going to demo the sails. Okay. And we're going to do, we're going to see, we're going to put some speed sales on these not weight sales just speed sales and um, we're gonna see how fast it goes with speed two speed sales on it and if it changes anything on this boat so give me a few seconds to throw those on and I'll be right back all right so 
we replace the weight sails, the large weight sail and the medium weight sail, with a large speed and a medium speed. So we're going to test to see if this makes the tramp freighter faster or it makes it slower. And is it viable to replace the sails on it or not? So we're going to do this test. So here we go. So 17.7 knots with speed sails. So that tell is telling me that it didn't change anything. Having weight sails and speed sails didn't change on the speed of how fast this tramp freighter actually goes. So let's recap on the tramp freighter. So you're starting out unofficial unofficial it doesn't matter um, and you drop your basic common shipyard and you get the materials you need to build your tramp freighter um, the recommendation from testing is you drop one of your cargo racks you leave your weight sails on there is no point of changing weight sails to speed sails Due to the fact it does not change the speed of the ship at all. But it does change how much weight you can actually put on the ship. Since the weight sails decrease the payload that you are carrying. Um, so, this is a basic transport ship in the beginning of a new season. Also... In PvP, they use it to grief other players, but it's mostly a transport in the beginning to get players from point A to point B. Um, so, and that's it. So, all in all, um, Tramp Raider, beginner boat, nothing more. Um, so make sure you like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell if you want to see more videos of these. Again, like I said, we're going to be doing a many parts series on mod boats. Um, the next one will be the COG. We're going to go over the COG, how fast it goes, um, what can you put on the COG. Um, like the Tramp, there's really not much you can put on the Tramp. Um, can't put cannons on it. It's just pretty much a transfer boat. Um, so that's about it. Hope you liked the video and have a good one.